Yo, Manny, what's up, dude? Turning 47. I love to hear it. 40s are that. 40s are that good age. 40s got that good, good where you hopefully have your shit together and you like know what you want. God, your 20s are. It used to be, I feel like, that your teens and 20s were where you were like, I don't know what I'm doing in life, but now that goes well into our 30s. The 40s is where it's at. Look what I just broke out of my closet to show you for this video. I should have put it on. This is my Melrose jacket that we go roller skating in, that Jenny steals from me when she steals my boyfriend, the bitch. Dude, the hanger just broke, probably because it's literally been from 1980, five, six, four. Okay, say a number, Jackie, figure it out. Happy, happy birthday, Manny. Okay, you want to hear something inspiring from Glow? Where... Where do I begin? You know, the, that whole experience, you know, um, me and all the girls were all still best friends. And that whole experience was really special for so many reasons, I think. The major one, I've been acting since I was a little kid and never have I had an opportunity to be on a show with more than one or two other random women. So for there to have been a show where 15 powerful, loud, interesting, different women of every age, color, shape, and size were able to come together and make this thing, created by women, written by mostly women, directed by mostly women, you know, that's it's 2021 too, whatever year it is, but you know, that's still really, really rare. So it's just amazing to be part of it all. Another, another really amazing uh, thing about GLOW is that I think a lot of us went in there not really being athletes. Really just, I mean, I was just such a theater kid through and through that I just lied at the audition and they asked if we were, if I was athletic and I said, yeah. I mean, I didn't fully lie. I said I hiked and I do Pilates and I could, I could move and dance. But I didn't like lie and say I was Mia Hamm. Not that that would have helped me to be a pro soccer player on GLOW. What am I saying? The point is, you know, we all just said we were super athletic and up until that point, I'd never really kicked, hit, caught a ball of any kind and we get thrown in the ring for a month of wrestling training before every season with Emmy-winning stunt coordinator Shauna Duggins and wrestling royalty Chavo Guerrero. And we don't have stunt doubles. And these 15 crazy chickens just get in a ring and really learn to wrestle and learn to take care of each other. And all the limitations we had put on ourselves our whole lives about whether we were or weren't athletes sort of just lifted all at once. It was really bad. <laughs> I didn't expect to, to get too, too deep on your birthday, Marco, but it was a really cathartic experience and just an unbelievable one from top to bottom. And thank you so much for participating in the Save Glow campaign. I did too. Love that you mailed Netflix nerds. Nerd's Rope, have you ever tried those? My number one favorite candy. Yeah, it's really weird what went on with Glow because I don't know if you know this, but we started shooting season four. We had shot two episodes and then COVID hit and the timing of it just sucked and we were never able to go back. Yeah, one of a pretty big, pretty big loss for everybody. All right, not to end on a sad note. Manny, you are the man. Happy 47th, bro. Maybe one day you'll get to see this freaking awesome jacket. I hope you get to meet the cast of Glow, too. They're pretty, pretty. It's just a gaggle of bad bitches. Maybe happy to meet you, man. Happy birthday, Manny. Have the best day. Take care.